They're true. He has a set data bank of images that he pulls from. You see all the scraps that he uses. And what I'm working on now is, is more of a, a smaller detail of some of the larger systems that he's mapped out. They're mostly abstract. You see little details that you can pick out and recognize. You might see a, a knot on a tree or part of a hand. It's very, very ambiguous. I just do the monkey work, basically. It's not part of the process that he needs to be involved with. A majority of the processes are very laborious. They can take several months, maybe, for a complex drawing. The process is fairly simple. Um, Arturo obviously creates the drawing, and we paint on one side of it. The drawing is on the reverse side, and then I use an X-Acto blade to cut out that exact shape, and it must be the exact um, shape. It has to resemble the curves of animated cartoons, and then I burnish the edges so it's completely flat, and you just see color that's then attached to a museum board. You're not left with looking at it as a process. You only see the line and the color, and you're no longer thinking about the hand of the artist is completely removed, and you're just impacted by the reality and the sensation of this colored image. Arturo is constantly busy at his table. He starts with stock imagery and he ends up with these creations that honestly I don't know how, it's just hours and hours of work, I don't know how he ends up at uh, the places that he arrives, but that's, that's part of the astonishing aspect of his work.